The nomination process for 102 parliamentary constituencies spread across 21 states and union territories where polling would be held on April 19. First phase of the Lok Sabha elections began today. The last date for filing nomination is March 27, Election Commission said. However, due to a festival, March 28 is the last date for filing nomination in Bihar. Ahead of the Lok Sabha elections, the opposition parties trained guns at the Chief Minister of Assam, Himanta Biswa Sarma, and his government by releasing a 40-page charge sheet revealing a range of issues pertaining to Sarma's administration. Mentioning a range of allegations including corruption, failure to look into the persisting human elephant conflict, rising prices, syndicates, schemes, issue of illegal immigrants, rampant toll taxes, and several others, the opposition parties have accused the present government of alleged failure in the governance and ineffective policy implementation to substantiate these claims. Ahead of the upcoming Lok Sabha election, the ruling BJP in Tripura has formed a 74-member Lok Sabha Election Management Committee for the two parliamentary seats including West and East ST in the state. The committee was formed following a meeting of the election committee chaired by BJP State President Rajiv Bhattacharya, Assam Tripura General Secretary Organization Ravindra Raju, General Secretaries Amit Rakshid and Bipin Debarma, among others. We have formed this committee to oversee the entire election process in both seats. A total of 74 members were selected with 37 members for each seat. The central government has submitted an affidavit in the Supreme Court opposing the stay of the Election Commissioners Act. It has stated that the independence of the Election Commission of India ECI, is not dependent on the inclusion of a judiciary member in the selection panel. The centre has further argued that the high constitutional functionaries are presumed to act in a fair manner. It has asserted that the competence and eligibility of the election commissioners are not under question. The centre has also accused the petitioners of attempting to stir up political controversy. A heartbreaking tragedy struck Churachanpo district of Manipur, sending shockwave in the entire district after four displaced children drawn in the infamous Tuta River. The four children displaced by the ongoing conflict in the seat were taking refuge at the ECA Cannon Relief Camp. The victims identified as siblings Lang Choi Hoi, 9 years old, and Tong Ko Hao, 6 years old, along with their companions Laleng Chung Lupo, 6 years old, and Tang Go Hao, 4 years old, ventured to the river edge last afternoon, March 19, for a routine task of washing at around 2 p.m. Russia has claimed that France is already prepared to send around 2,000 ground troops to Ukraine amid war. Russian Foreign Intelligence Service head Sergei Nariski said French President Emmanuel Macron is hiding exact number of French soldiers already killed in Ukraine amid fear of protests in France. Earlier, Macron said future NATO troop deployment to Ukraine couldn't be ruled out. <laughs> 